Hello my people uh, Today is Saturday uh, I am going to the prison station to visit some prisoners Well, uh, that is the place uh, I'm going to see if I will be allowed to enter and visit some prisoners yeah well sometimes uh, these guys don't allow people to visit on saturdays i'm going to see if they will do me this favor yeah let me go and ask them for permission well uh, you see that guy with uniform is the prison guard and he said that today it's not possible but I have to come back next Sunday not the tomorrow tomorrow is Sunday but not tomorrow but the other Sunday the next Sunday uh, I wanted to visit some prisoners who are in this prison station because uh, although I don't have any person like a relative there but uh, I feel like visiting these people yeah some of them they don't have relatives they don't have family here and they were detained yeah, this is the prison building yeah this is the prison building some they don't have uh, relatives here and uh, when they see visitors uh, it can make them happy because they need people to chat with they need people to see how they are and to know how they are that's very good yeah that's very good and i also want to use this uh, opportunity to tell you that it's good to visit prisoners no matter you know the person just go to any prison station you know and visit the prisoners god will bless you for that there are innocent people in this prison and no one will hear them unless you go and hear their story yeah go and hear from them what happened ah. since i didn't succeed uh, to visit the prisoners i thought of having a walk in this place uh, this area is called the uh, Emilia Dausi in Ulongwe town. Uh, Emilia Daus in history, uh, she was a woman who uh, played the role in the fight for independence. Yeah, I'm not sure which year she died, but she is not alive. This fact, I'm very sure she is not alive see these streams blue gums yeah these blue gums uh, they protect this land from soil or erosion from soil erosion you know that uh, soil erosion uh, destroys so many uh, places and some people plant these kind of trees to protect the land from this kind of uh, calamity yeah you see this place is nice to catch fresh hair yeah this place is cool 
to relax. If you don't know this place, this place is located in Ulong town in Angonia district. And if you don't know Angonia, you see, I'm returning because of that dog. He's barking. He's barking. And I don't like dogs. Yeah. That dog. That one. Is trying to bark. And to avoid problems with the with the dog let me use another road but he's very lucky because i don't carry anything on my hand otherwise he would be regretted for backing i know how to teach them strong lessons yeah this is Ulongo town in angonia district So, if you are new to my channel, uh, kindly subscribe and be welcome to my channel. My name is Ajidi Sozenyo, your boy from Mozambique. As always, I will keep showing you beautiful places. This is my uh, this is my job to show you beautiful places yeah and uh, as you can see this place is also beautiful beauty is not only described by Uh, tall buildings or uh, big infrastructures this nature is also beautiful this nature is also beautiful that's why uh, you see people who understand and they know the value of nature they live continents far from Africa and they come here to observe nature closely here in Africa. People, they come to see mountains, trees, and other uh, natural things that exist here in Africa. While us Africans, we think differently. We want to go to Europe, to America to see big towers to see cars and other things myself I suggest we come here you see we visit Africa so we will enjoy the freshness of the hair and also to see the beauty that African landscapes offer. As you can see this place here. Can you imagine the beauty that this place offers? Can you imagine? This is what I like about Africa. What we have in Africa is natural, is original. Even the beauty of people in Africa is original. Yeah, you will see beautiful people with natural look. Our food is natural and healthy. You see? This place is where people come to farm uh, 
Angonia is a district rich in terms of agriculture. People here cultivate in farms. As you can see from here up to there, these are farms. People produce maize here. They produce crop. Everywhere we see farms. Just to see this open place, this open space. It's where people produce maize. Uh, in Angonia, people not only produce maize, uh, they also uh, produce beans, cassava, lettuce, cabbage, onion, carrot, a lot of things we find here in Angonia. That's why I like Angonia. Personally, I like Angonia. Angonia, if you live in Angonia, you will, not, you will never starve. Yeah, you will never die of hunger. And uh, Angona is a place to live. I have said it in my previous videos that Angonia is one of the best districts uh, in Mozambique due to the fact that the temperature here is good and also there is much food here. This is the evidence. People are preparing for uh, next uh, seasons of uh, food production yeah of food production they are trying to prepare the land in order to sow seeds and produce food in the future yeah as I said Africa is beautiful naturally just to see the environment even here where I am you will see that everything is beautiful I'm talking about the environment this open space is good for you to relax yeah, this place is good for you to relax. Once again, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe, leave a comment. Uh, I will end this video here and we will meet again. We will meet again in my next video. My name is Ajid Sozinho. Don't forget to share my video with your friends. Let them see the beauty of this land and also support my channel by recommending to your friends through uh, sharing and also through telling people to subscribe to my channel. So thank you very much and have a good day.